matter, matter, its meaning and composition. There are various materials around us such as wood, sugar, stone, iron, common salt, water, oil, petrol, nitrogen, carbon dioxide, oxygen and water vapors. The following two properties are common to all the materials irrespective of these being visible or not. 1. All materials take up some space. The amount of space occupied by a body is called its volume. 2. All material bodies have some mass. Mass is a measure of quantity of matter. From these two points, it can be concluded that anything which occupies space and has a mass is known as matter. Matter is made up of tiny particles called atoms and molecules that cannot be seen by the human eyes as they are tiny and small. States of matter Matter exists in three different states that is solid, liquid and gas. Solids Solids have a definite shape and occupy a definite space because their particles are attached by strong attractive forces called intermolecular force. Example, iron, sand, copper, etc. Characteristics of solids In solids, the molecules are held together with very strong forces, that is, the intermolecular force of attraction between molecules of solid is much more than the force of repulsion between them. Thus, in solid, molecules are closely and orderly arranged. The solids can be characterized by the given properties. 1. The solids have definite shape and volume. Activity To show that solids have definite volume. Take 250 ml beaker filled with water up to the brim and now drop a stone into it. Note the volume of water that have overflowed. Observation Note the volume of water overflowed by taking different liquids and different containers. The volume of overflowed liquid water is equal to the volume of the solid stone immersed in liquid water. Result Solids have definite volume. 2. Solids do not diffuse into another solid. 3. Solids are not easily compressible. Reason In solids, molecules are very closely packed and intermolecular space are very less. So, they cannot be reduced further. 4. On heating solids, change into liquids. Reason Heat provides energy to molecules to overcome the intermolecular force of attractions for changing the solids into liquids. Liquids Liquids have no definite shape but occupy a definite space. The particles of liquids are less attracted with each other than solids, example, water, milk, fruit juice, etc. Characteristics of liquids in liquids, the intermolecular force of attraction is slightly higher than the force of repulsion. Hence, the constituent particles can aggregate but show a tendency to flow. Liquids can be characterized by the given properties. 1. Liquid has a definite volume. Activity To show that liquids do not change their volume. Fill 100 ml of water into graduated measuring cylinders. We find water level in every graduated measuring cylinder shows a mark of 100 ml. Result, liquids do not change their volume. 2. Liquids take the shape of vessel. That is, they do not have definite shape. Activity To show that Liquids take the shape of vessels in which they are poured. Take a coffee mug and fill it with water. It takes the shape of coffee mug. Now transfer the water from coffee mug to round deep plate. 
again pour the water to a cup it takes the shape accordingly observation water takes the shape of container when it is poured into it result liquids do not have definite shape 3 liquid has a tendency to diffuse into another liquid reason in liquids molecules are loosely packed and their molecules are in motion so they have tendency to diffuse into another liquid gases gases do not have any definite shape and occupy any space available to them the molecules of gases show very less attraction between them example oxygen air nitrogen carbon dioxide etc characteristics of gases any substance which has neither definite shape nor definite volume is known as gas in a gas the forces of attraction between the molecules are very weak and can be broken very easily by atmospheric conditions therefore the molecules move freely in all possible directions gases can be characterized by the given properties one gases do not have a fixed shape and volume activity to show that gases do not have a fixed shape take three balloons of different shapes and inflate with air the air inside the balloons takes the shape of balloons result this proves that gas has no fixed shape two gases have no free surface area reason molecules escape from the open surface three gases can be compressed easily four gases can be diffused into another gas reason molecules in gases move very fast five gases can flow in all directions six gases on cooling change into liquids reason cooling increases intermolecular force of attraction and reduces intermolecular repulsion activity to show that gases can be compressed easily take a disposable syringe and close its mouth by fevicol let it dry now take out plunger from the syringe and during this process the syringe gets filled with air now place the plunger in the syringe and push it with inward force observation the plunger moves inside the syringe on applying force if this force is removed then plunger comes to the original position result gases can be compressed distinguishing properties of solids liquids and gases basis for comparison solids liquids gases one shape and volume retains the same shape and volume retains the same volume but takes the shape of its container takes the shape of its container and the particles move around freely in the container has not same volume to intermolecular space very less more large 3 arrangement of molecules particles are arranged in a fixed way and do not move around particles are not arranged in a fixed way but always move around in random manner no fixed arrangement particles have a lot of energy to move around four energy low medium high five compressibility difficult nearly difficult easy six fluidity cannot flow flows from higher to lower level flows in all directions 7 intermolecular force of attraction maximum medium minimum 8 storage 
don't need container for storage cannot be stored without container needs closed container for storage